What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, EW Images from EWImages.net. Hopefully you're staying safe and staying home during this pandemic. In the spirit of create no matter what, I wanted to show you two ways that you can take self-portraits with your Nikon mirrorless or DSLR. Coming up. Sorry I don't have the Atomos Ninja to display my menu settings, but I can still show you on my Galaxy S10. So on your Nikon mirrorless or DSLR, you would go to the menu setting and go to photo shooting menu and scroll over to interval timer shooting. In here, you would set up the interval, which would basically be the amount of time in between shots that you would take. I generally set this to about 10 seconds to give myself time in between poses. On the second one, it will show intervals, time shots, and basically this shows how many shots do you want within that interval. I've set mine to about five shots. And from there, click on start, and it will start taking pictures. For the second option, you would come out of the photo shooting menu and scroll down to the setup menu and scroll until you get to connect to smart device. On the mirrorless system, you'll have the option for pairing to Bluetooth or Wi-Fi connection. Once you've established the Wi-Fi connection, you can then connect to SnapBridge and control your camera. This setup is different for DSLR setups, so I'll show you that in one second. On a Nikon DSLR, like the D750, the layout may be different, but the functionality would still be the same. So you would still go to the photo shooting menu and go to interval timer shooting and enter the number of seconds between intervals and the number of shots between those intervals. But the second method does differ from the first. You would still come to the setup menu and scroll down to the option for Wi-Fi, and then you would connect to your smart device using Nikon wireless mobile unit. So to recap, on your Nikon mirrorless or DSLR, you can go to the photo shooting menu and go to interval timer shooting and use it as a self timer for your self portraits. Or on Nikon DSLRs, you can use the app Nikon wireless mobile unit or on the Z6 system, you can use SnapBridge to connect to your phone and take a self-portrait. So, with all that out of the way, let's go down to the studio and get some self-portraits in. All right, so now that we're in the studio, I wanna show you a quick two light setup. As my key light, I have the Explore 400 Pro and a 43 inch umbrella softbox. And as my kicker light, I have the 8200 and a 16 by 48 inch strip softbox. So hopefully you found this helpful. If so, hit that like button because it greatly helps out the channel. Subscribe if you want to see more content just like this. And let me know in the comments section if you had any self-portrait challenges. And drop your Instagram handle so I can check out those self-portraits. I'm EW Images and I'll catch you in the next one.